How's it going elites? My name's Mikey from Detroit, Michigan, and today I'm going to be showing you how I was able to play for $300 on bubble shooter tournaments without making a deposit. And I'm going to give you an idea of everything that happens when you play for big money on a skills game. Welcome back to another video from the Mikey Slice YouTube channel. If this is your first time here and you want to learn more about how to make money playing skills games or playing events with free entries to win real cash prizes, make sure you subscribe and tick the bell so you don't miss another video. Multiple times a day, I'm checking my phone, opening the Bubble Shooter Tournaments game to see if I have $60 or more in my skills account. If I do, I'll play for $100 or $300, depending on how much money I have in my skills account. Whenever I win one of those games, I immediately make a withdraw, which puts my account balance back to zero. But you might be wondering how my account balance increases without me having to make a deposit. Well, that's because Skills has a Refer a Friend program, where I get $10 in bonus cash if someone uses my promo code on their first Skills deposit. Since the person using the code will also get $10 in bonus cash, it shouldn't be that hard to convince someone to make a deposit, especially if they're already about to make one, and they do what everyone else does when they see it, enter promo code field at checkout which is to go straight to Google and search for a promo code. Right now, if you go to Google and type in the search term skills promo code, you should see a Google snippet preview of my website, skillspromocodes.com, and it should show my promo code 2F05J, as well as instructions on how to use it. So, if you haven't made your first skills deposit and you're watching this video and want to make your first skills deposit today, make sure you use my promo code 2F05J before selecting your deposit amount. If done correctly, once your deposit is complete, we'll both get $10 in bonus cash in our skills accounts. Now you can even go to the menu on any skills game, find your skills promo code link, and copy that link and leave it as a comment below to see if someone watching this video wants to use your code instead of mine. So do yourself a favor, pause this video, find your refer a friend code, and leave it as a comment below, then press play to continue watching the rest of the video. If you don't do this, you're leaving free money on the table. So I highly suggest you go find your skills promo code and leave it as a comment below, and I'll even pin the very first person that follows these instructions, I'll, I'll pin that comment to the top and everyone will see your promo code before anyone else's. Since I spend a lot of money and time to promote my promo code as much as I can, it doesn't take long for me to get enough people to use my code in order for me to play for $300 matches, like the one I'm about to show you. If the next time I open this bubble shooter game I'm short $20, I can just go to the ticket store and get bonus cash and make up the difference. What's your favorite thing to redeem in the ticket store? Let me know in the comments below. What really sucks is when I have more than enough bonus cash in my account to play for $300. For instance, if I have $250 the next time I open Bubble Shooter and I play for $300, if I win that game, I'll have $125 available for withdraw, but there will be $250 in bonus cash still in my skills account. Therefore, all of that will be lost when I make the withdrawal for 125. Had I opened the game a few hours earlier, I would have avoided this problem and I would have had less time waiting between my next big money cash game that I play. But it's a great problem to have, I'm not complaining. I get about $100 to $250 in bonus cash every day from people using my promo code on their first deposit. Since enough people use my promo code on their first deposit, I hit this play button next to the $300 match in Bubble Shooter. Then I hope that I can get matched against someone who is worse than I am. If not, I'm at greater risk of losing all the bonus cash that I worked so hard to get. When I hit this begin match now button, it then searches for players that are similar in both experience and skill. If skills can't find someone right away, the game will let me play and submit my score while they find a worthy opponent for me. 
Sometimes I get matched right away and I'm playing against someone who has already completed the match or I'm playing against someone who is currently playing at the same time. Then there's other times where it goes pending. If they don't find someone within seven days, I'll get refunded the full $175 and I can try again. It looks like I got matched up against Sand Sam right away, but before I show you the replay and the results, let's compare our profiles to see how this match could turn out. As you can see, he's played a lot of matches in order to win over 12,000 of them. His best winning streak is the same as mine at 15, and his win-loss over the past 10 games is 50-50. However, versus me, I've won 60% of the last 10 games. So based on this small sample size of data, I'm a slight favorite even though he has more experience than I do. His bubble shooter tournaments rank is 100, whereas mine is only 73. So he is definitely way more experienced in this game than I am, but who actually has the skills to pay the bills? We'll find out soon. There's a lot on the line for both players. Each of us are risking $175 to win $300. Now, I spend a little over $1,000 a month to operate over here at Mikey Slice headquarters. So winning these big cash matches is critical to my success in both Bubble Shooter and here on YouTube. Now, let's check out the replays side by side to see how each of us played in this event. As you can see, we both get the same board with the same color bubbles. Whoever scores highest within three minutes wins $300. Before you continue though, I want you to pause this video and comment below who you think is gonna win, me or Sand Sam, and why. Then click play and see if you're right. Yeah baby, I won the $300, which means I now have $125 in real cash that I can withdraw to my bank account right now. But I'll lose the $175 in bonus cash. What would you do? Withdraw or keep playing to win more? Let me know in the comments below. I'm going to withdraw, but I would like to know what you would do and why you would do it that way because it's one of those things that I've been battling myself over don't know if I should withdraw or if I should keep playing. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Even though I won, I still know there's room to improve, 
So I'll watch more of my replays and find the inaccuracies and fix them in order to ensure that I can win more games in the future. I haven't won a pro league in a while, so I know I'm not the greatest bubble shooter. However, I am $125 richer, so I can invest in myself to make a more profitable player in the future. Wait, don't you go anywhere without checking out this bubble shooter video? Or check out the video that YouTube recommends. Either way, don't forget to smash that like button before you go, and I'll see you tomorrow.